to start, to start, what you want to do is, I'm going to go to this wall here, right, I've said this in my other video, what you want to do is, I'm going to get your right hand, put it on the normal wall, you see, right hand on the normal wall here, and then your left hand on the slippery wall, you want to push down with your right hand first, whoop, and then your left hand, whoop, like that, ah, easy, see, exactly, and then, you want to do it quicker, the quicker you do it, the, uh, the further you go, you don't want to do it at the same time though, because otherwise it'll mess up, big sad, okay, so, um, hey, ta-da, okay, and then if you want to go, if you want to go like forward, backwards and stuff, yeah, if you want to go forward and backwards and stuff, you want to go, you want to bounce here, with your right hand, and then left hand, go, 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 the left hand will go that way, and then it'll make you go that way, and then you'll go like that, you see, forwards. If you want a wall run on slippery wall, I recommend using the boost, which the boost is this, where you do this, you put your arm around it a little bit, and then pull like that, and it makes you go flying. It doesn't go super far though, but it can go pretty far. How do you do the launching thing? How do you launch? The launch, the launch, you put your hand on the other side of the slippery wall. Um, so if I show you using this normal part of the wall, if I show you using this part of the wall here, you want to do this, you want to put your hand there and then pull through. And you can actually do that without that, you can just, you know. You just, you just pull back hard. Uh, I've also figured out, I've also um, noticed that if you put your hand, the further in you put your hand, the uh, less you will like go forward. And then if you put your hand really close to like here, you'll go even further. Well, that was a bad one, but still. And then, uh, yeah, that's about it. And next, so next, what you wanna do is, you wanna come to here, and then all you gotta do is do the same thing with the forward, but here it is slightly different. You wanna go forward with both hands. You wanna go forward with this one, and then your left one. You go right, you, you push with your right, and then you push with your left. So you go like that, and it makes you go absolutely flying like that. And it's pretty, pretty neat. Now I'm gonna teach you how to wall climb. All right, the next thing, wall climbing. What you wanna do with wall climbing? You wanna do this with wall climbing, you wanna hand here. This is the start of wall climbing. Uh, when I first started wall climbing, I started wall climbing like this. This was my first ever wall climb when I done that. This is how I used to wall climb like long time ago. In like, I don't know, April or something. All right, with normal wall climbing, you don't want to do that, but you can do that to practice. You want to put one hand on the wall here, and then you want to push down into like a diagonal type of thing like that. You want to push down like that, and then same with the other one. That will push you into the wall. If you do that and push off, then that's bad. You just want to push down diagonally, but you don't want to push off. Pushing off, that means you're just, that means you're pushing your arm in like Z axis forward. You don't want to do that. You want to push Y and Z basically. You want to just do that. You want to push off a little bit though, only a little bit, just so you can actually get off the wall. And then that will just send you up. And then the more you practice, the further you go. Once you get to here, you just go like, whip, whip, like that. And that's it. Okay, so with branching, what you want to do is, uh, you want to just, you, you, you pick a branch, you stand on it, and then you just jump to another branch, let's say that one, you just jump to it, simple as that, right? And then you jump to your next branch, simple as that. But you also want to juke monkeys as well. So once you do that, you you wanna you don't wanna go forward again, do you? You wanna like something 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 like that, you know? You know? And then right? And then once you do that, you should be good. Because all you need, all you need to do to do that. Shut your mum bonky. Okay, um anyway. Uh you wanna you, you just jump to your branch, right? Let's uh, say so you wanna jump up to this one. This is a this is a good little trick that I like to do. You jump up here and then you jump over here. It's a little trick, but everyone will be able to do it. You jump up here again, you turn, jump here. Once you get good at that, you should be able to do juke monkeys like that. And then once you get, it's look, it's, branching is simple really. You just want to be able to juke monkeys by bouncing off a tree like this. Speaking of juking, that's the next thing that we're going to learn how to do. Yay! Everyone say yay! Yay! yay. yay. Monkeys, okay. with, with juking, what you want to do is, what you want to do is, with juking, you basically just want to, 
Yeah, if they're coming towards you this way, you wanna whoop. Simple as that, right? But that's just normal stupid duking for default. You want advanced duking, right? So what you wanna do is you get up to a tree and then you go like this, then you do the stupid fish VR thing where you go, where you do that. You, yeah. hmm? Oh my gosh, guys, you yeah. know, oh my god! Alright guys, 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 stick to the script and come after me, guys. Uh, um, uh, I'm gonna duke all of you. Oh my god! Oh my god! Roger, Roger! Oh my god! Okay, right, anyway, that's how you do duking, right? But I like to go around trees. If your arms are long enough, you can just do that. And how you do that, you just put your arm here, and you go around a tree. And that, you just put your arm there and then do a 180 in real life. Yeah, and then that's it. Yeah, sort of. If your arms ain't long enough, what you can do is you can just yoink yourself around it like that. Yeah. Alright, with this material, you can basically just see the hand through the walls, which is pretty sweet. Alright, anyway, yeah. Um, Alright, gotta. Alright, with this slide, you, you wanna just put your hand over this, and then as you can see, it is now on the other side right here. And then you just wanna. Pull yourself like this, like this, and that that's that part, but I normally do it, I normally yoink to the middle of it, so I just, oh crap, I just jump to the middle, and then I pull through like that, you just want to pull like this, you want to just yoink like that, right? Alright, everyone, everyone, stick to the script, and I'm going to juke you, and I need you all to run through here when I do it, and I'm going to do this, okay, like Fish VR did, go there guys, go, go here, go here, go here. Go here. I will. All right, guys. Are you ready? Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? Three, two, one, go. All right. Yeah, that was it, really. That that was the thing. Um, I also do this as you saw. I yoinked it. What I did was I jumped to here, and then I just pulled, pulled, like put my hand there, and then I yoinked through, and it looks really nice. And then you just, if you do it really quick, you can actually do this better. Actually, that's a really good idea. I can keep this material on too. Wait, no, let me do the double wall thing. All right, well, guys, next thing, what you want to do is, you want to come up to the wall, and instead of just hugging up, right, like you normally would, you want to put your arm on the other side of the wall. As you can see, you can see it through the wall there. Or you can put both hands through and one hand just like sticks. And then you just, once it's in the wall, you want to make sure that you come over here and then you just pull down like this. And then you'll just start going up. It's really useful because that way you don't need to waste your time with both hands, right? And then both hands is harder. So yeah, you literally just... And it's nice and easy. You can do it on each side as well. I like to, I don't really do that much, I just will, will run up, and then I get to there. Oh, I like doing that too. Yeah, okay, so there's also another thing with this. When you're on the Very double unfair. walls, when you're on the double walls, you can just do this thing that I showed you on the uh, slide. You can just yoink round here like this, and then it will just send you flying round. So it will just do this. Oh, I didn't do it. And then you just... And it'll send you flying around. Let me go a bit higher. And it'll send you flying. And then I, I normally go around both. Or I just jump to a branch here and then start branching off. Rag spinning. Alright, with rag spinning, what you gotta do is you pick a branch. You can go any branch. Uh, 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 yeah. You normally see it over there and they call it the hospital flip when it's not. It's really called the rag spin. It's made by that too much. Again. And then he, uh, yeah. So what you gotta do is you just come to here. And you just pull, come down, and then you can tilt your head, and then you just pull back up. Dead walk. A lot of people just call it the Toomey's trick or the under the bridge trick, but it's actually called the dead walk. Uh, it's called the dead walk because actually you look dead when you go under it because you have to tilt your head. So all you gotta do is again come to the bridge, and then you wanna pull down, tilt your head, then you just pull like that. You yoink like that, right? You can do one jump. All I'm doing is this. I'm just Here's me on the bridge, and then I'm jumping like that. I'm going, I'm pulling down like that. So this is what it looks like. I'm doing this. Right, that's all I'm doing. I'm literally just underneath the bridge. But I like to do it in one jump because it's easier. Um, if, you, if you're if you like too short, like most of you are, because you're all skill issue, um, you can just 
do this, and since you're like here, you can just yoink your wrist. Just yoink your wrist like that. And then it. They can also do this version of it. Like, look. They can also go like this, spin in a circle, and flip out. There's no reason to do that. Um, yeah. You just. This is all you do. And how you do that, I like to practice like this, and then you just do that. If you do it quick enough, you just. You literally just slide through. Uh, yeah, that's about it. There's another thing that I do as well, where you um, where I just yoink down like this. Oh, I didn't do it. Where you yoink down like this. <laughs> right? And uh, if you want to do that, yeah, I know. It, that's why I do it. <laughs> if you want to do it, what you gotta do? <laughs> what you do is you yoink to here. And then you put your hand underneath, and then you just yoink through like that. So it's literally just like that. But if you do it quick enough, and you like do it faster than gravity pulls you down, then you literally disappear and you go absolutely ooga booga crazy like this. I hope you enjoyed. Did I even come back into fright by all my did? You did. What, what is he? What, what, mm. Okay. You know, you put your fingers on your nose and then you put it back together. Oh, I know what you took. <laughs> God, well, you're not special! Hey, <laughs> <laughs> Zane, your turn. Silly Billy Fam! Silly Billy Fam! Silly Billy Fam!